Hello guys, my name is Matthew and in today's video I will show you the comparison of PFSense with Ubiquiti. First, I'll show you PFSense, solutions and features, pros and cons, and then the pricing pipelines. Same thing with Ubiquiti. I'll show you the solutions and features, pros and cons, and then the pricing plans. In the end, I will show you the differences between these two programs and explain to you which one, which one is better at least in my opinion. For learning more about these programs, there will be links in the description underneath this video. You can also write down the co in the comment section your thoughts and your uh, questions, if you have any, and we will try to answer them. So let's start with PFSense. NetGate virtual appliances with PFSense Plus software extend your applications and connectivity to authorize users everywhere. Through Amazon AWS and Microsoft Azure Cloud Services, network your employees, partners, customers, and other parties to share resources in Site2 Cloud, Cloud2 Cloud, and Virtual Private Cloud. Connectivity. Full firewall VPN router functionality all-in-one available in the cloud starting at $0.08 per hour. As we can see, we can straight away explore the cloud. This is too big. And you really can get to know the PFSense pools as they claim. You can get the features and then the performance, technology resources and how to buy. Basically, the only problem is that they are very sketchy with uh, demos and uh, free trials so you can basically just obviously shop for parts for example desktop appliances at amazon as you can see their amazon like site you can start at netgate uh, 1 100 to 100 to 100 max and so on and so on and basically you can really pick the one that you need but uh let's go there in a second then we have appliances here with pfsense plus applications firewall router vpn attack prevention filtering and also tnsr applications then we can sort uh, pfsense by customers and that by solutions firewall router vpn attack prevention this is the main site that you are going to focus if you are deciding to buy pfsense product then by industry, construction, defense, education, healthcare, and IT services. Let's start with, with firewall, for example. Now you can just check uh, the solution that you are interested in. Firewall, industry, let's go with education. And you can basically check the story behind this department or this solution part at uh, uh, PFSense, if it makes you buy the product, you can go to buy now. And as you can see, we've already been there. So you can basically just have to check. You can uh, put it into comparison and basically, basically see everything that you like. Starting at $179 up to $3,148. Uh, we can check the pricing as well for appliances, for example, and straight away, this is the fastest way, basically how to scroll through what they are offering. Starting at NetGate uh, 1100, as we started before, ending at NetGate 1541, which is basically the top product. Then we have PFSense Cloud on AWS, Basically, you can get a free trial, but AWS is not included. And also Azure. From $0.08 per hour to $0.24 per hour. You can basically get this one as well. Also free trial, but not included Azure. So that's a little bit, you know, you really want everything in under one roof.
So let's move to Ubiquity. Ubiquity is basically everything that they claim they are doing. They are really simplifying IT and it just works. I really love this site that they have, that they put together. So even from the first touch, you can see that they, are, they know what they're doing. For example, network applications. You can really see the software they are using. Basically, it's very transparent. Also, protect applications. You can get all the cameras inside your pad, for example, or, or your iPhone. Access applications and talk applications. So this one is really like next generation. As you can see, like I'm not saying that this is not beautiful, uh, that PFSense world is very nice, but it's not ubiquity. They are really know what they are doing. Also, everything is shiny. Basically, they are uh, asking you to sign up, start the ubiquity account, and start the journey. We can uh, we have to scroll all the way down to check the ubiquity store, and there you have it. You can yeah we are visiting from from store in or we want to see the European store in uh, euros for example we can do that no problem and you can see everything best sellers dream machine new products starting with antennas and goals all the way to racks all the cables early access and stuff like that Network, protection, door access, accessories, basically all the cables and everything you will need, Amplify products, wireless products, wired products, and also the early access that you can get your hands on. Obviously, all of this is backed by the ubiquity software which is very easy to deal with basically very transparent very very nice to have and also also very uh, very safe to use so guys i really like the ubiquity maybe i'm biased by it i'm not really sure but i would go just by uh, the simplicity of ubiquity it's really nice and that's what I'm into. So I would really go with them. If you have any other uh, option or any other questions that I couldn't cover in this short video, please ask them in the comment section. Feel free to subscribe. Thanks for watching and see you on the next one. Thank you very much.